Hello. In this video we will introduce you how to prepare and assemble the device for the first use. My name is Michael Klein, Draeger Academy in the headquarter in Lübeck. The device is delivered on a pallet. The complete device is wrapped with a foil. To unbox your device from the pallet, you must lose some screws and then you have a specific plate and ramp that you can roll up your device. In front of the ramp, you find a specific tool to loose the screw. After roll up the device from the pallet, we start to install the screen on the clamp. Lift the monitor and connect the clamp to the holder and fixate that on the device. Remove the safety package. Based on your specific configuration, you find different packages on the pallet. One of that package had all the accessories inside. The expiration valves, the needed flow sensor, different types of CO2 cuvettes, the CO2 mainstream holder, the CO2 mainstream sensor and the test lung that needed to fulfill the self-test. In a different package you find the host systems for the central gas supply, oxygen and air and the related instruction for use. The next step is to connect the O2 hose to the device. Remove the safety cap from the related adapter and connect the hose system to the device. Turn on the wheel only with your hands. Two different types of expiration valves can be used in our device. We deliver the device with the reusable expiration valve. The expiration valve will be connected to the device with a related place. Connect the expiration valve, turn the ring and you can hear a click. As next, you connect the flow sensor on the device. Put it in and push the flow sensor in the expiration valve. Close the clap. Connect the hinge arm to the rail on the device side. Connect the related hose system to your device. Different hose systems can be connected to our ventilator. The two hose system and a coax system, that is a hose in hose system. We connect the double hose system to the inspiratory part of our device and to the expiratory valve on the other side. Bring your hose system in the clamp of your hinged arm. The next step is to connect the CO2 mainstream sensor. The sensor is marked with a yellow connector. Place the CO2 sensor on the same color coded connector on the device. Use the safety cable management to save your cable. Place the sensor in the CO2 holder to save the sensor for using. Connect your main electricity cable and after that you can connect the device to the central gas station oxygen and air. Before you connect the device to your patient, a self-test is needed. To start the device, switch on the main switch on the right side of the device. After that, start the screen with a green knob. 